Good morning, everybody. Um, we are back again. The show is called TBR Solution Sports Forum. We are doing a special show um, because we saw what happened last night. What a beautiful game by Kaiser Chiefs, and then what a beautiful game by Morocco Soilos. Um, you know, I've been saying it over and over again that given a chance, Alpha Zwan is going to do well at Kaiser Chiefs. He needs some time. But um, I must say, credit must go to Alpha himself and also the team. I know it's only the first win. There is a long road. There's still a long way to go. But um, you could see as they were playing that, uh, you know, they were playing with purpose. And the energy in the team is quite exciting. And the speed, you know, and uh, Bavuma in the goal, he, he has done exceptionally well. Um, you know, uh, the saves that he made, starting with the game of Royal AM, he has been doing well. Uh, it shows that he has raised his hands to say, I want to be the number one goalkeeper at Kaiser Chiefs. So, which is quite exciting. And one of the things that I notice, I may be wrong here, it looks like, Arthur looks like a softy, but he's not a softy. He's a very stern disciplinarian. One thing that I've observed, remember I said, I may be wrong, all right? I'm sure you also, you have observed. I've seen that Njabulo Ngobo has not featured uh, in the recent games. So I don't know whether it's one way or another of trying to discipline him or exact his authority in the team. Because remember, if the players don't respect you, uh, they'll do as they please. We've seen with uh, Eric Hang Ten, with Ronaldo, the players were looking at uh, Eric Hang Ten. How is he going to respond when Ronaldo left when he was not supposed to leave? Um, you know, but um, he made it clear that he's not going to accept that kind of a behavior. Um, and now you can see that uh, as much as they haven't started to win as Man United, but that bring discipline. This brings me back to what we have been asking at Orlando Pirates, why Mohango was not playing. The answer was not coming uh, clearly until at some point uh, Fadu uh, let the cat out of the bag to say they don't select a player because of performance only. They look at other issues, at other factors like arriving later there, arriving on time at the training. Uh, are you disciplined? Are you behaving well? And all those things, they contribute. And, and you know, if, if that is the case, I said parents have done well because we need to instill discipline. What we are observing, especially lately, we see that most of um, our youngsters or some of our youngsters are not disciplined. That's why sometimes teams lose uh, games because only discipline will take us to another level. If people are not disciplined, we'll have a problem. If that is correct, what I observe, that probably Arthur wants to exert his authority. And then he wants to make sure that he needs to be respected. And I also have to commend Kaiser Jr., who has been very consistent in supporting him, to say, you know what, be patient. Uh, Arthur knows the team. Arthur is going to do well. And I'm one of those people who believe that Arthur will do well. So congratulations to Kaiser Chiefs. They look good. Although Arthur wasn't happy with the performance, as compared to last week's performance, but I think they played very well. Uh, that's my opinion. Now let's go to Morocco Swans. Well done, uh, Maswai Swai. They were playing very well. It was um, a new look, Maswai Swai, with youngsters. And then uh, Nyatamba, you've, uh, you've done very well. And then uh, as a coach, um, I saw Dylan Kerr was there. And then, uh, but, uh, you know, I could see that you are motivating the players, talking to the players, encouraging them. And then at some point, I thought you guys were going to play 2-2. Two -two. 
And then they played a very beautiful football in Robert Swallows. And then if this is what is going to happen going forward, uh, it looks like uh, we are going to see good football. Uh, one cannot discard uh, Cape Town City. They played very well. They played very well. I think they were unlikely to lose the first game and the second game. Uh, Cape Town City, they look like a solid team. Eric Tingler, you're doing a good job. Uh, don't be discouraged. Yes, some of these things, they do happen. And then I want to hear from you people out there, what's your take? Do you think that Kaiser Chiefs has revived? Well, I don't know what's going to happen this coming Saturday. They're playing the big one. They're playing Mamelodi Sundowns. We'll talk about that one on Saturday morning. And then uh, thank you very much for subscribing and continue to subscribe and like and comment. I thank you. Hi, everybody. I'm sure you are all aware, just like I am, that things are tough. Financially, all of us are having it tough. But let me tell you, when things are like this, you have to do more. Learn more, read books that teaches about money, go to workshops that teaches about money, and then you'll be able to solve your problem. Now, I'm willing to give you this book for free, all right? I'm gonna give you this book for free so that you learn and start to understand how can you do what I did. Um, this book is called How I Turn 500 Rent Into a Million Rent Business. You know what? Maybe you can even do more, who knows? You can do more than what I did. Or, you know, keep on trying all the time or you'll be able to do what I did. So I learned from others and you'll also can learn what I learned from others. You'll get this book for free, but you have to be 55 years old or above and a member of GPF, an employee of government, so that we help you with your pension. Once you sign with us to help you with your pension, we'll courier this book for, uh, for free to you. I thank you.